Hello everybody, welcome to the show. If you're new here, uh, this is kind of what I do once a week. I take the whole week's worth of work and we kind of simplify it into some high speed time lapse. This way, um, we all kind of get to sit back and look at the whole project as a whole. These paintings take a long time to do, and I appreciate everyone who shares this time with me when we do this live streaming. Um, but these moments are easier to digest the work that's happening. So I suggest we sit back, relax, kick our feet up perhaps, grab our favorite beverage, and let's watch this last week in painting. So, by the way, I'll probably be chiming in with some silly facts here and there, and let's get to the broadcast already in progress. arts of humanity how about that like I knew I've been doing it for a long time but this is ridiculous I mean we're basically talking about cave paintings and all but nevertheless it's got to start somewhere doesn't it So it seems like that silly fact number one has led my own interest into paint brushes and the history of them. So uh, looking it up, uh, the paintbrush that resembles today dates back to prehistoric times. Uh, they found some fossilized brushes that were discovered in Egypt. They are made of split palm leaves um, and some earlier brushes. Uh, <laughs> we're made of sticks, bones, and even wood shavings, and that kind of makes sense, you know? You can shave wood down to accept porous materials and spread it, so yeah, I dig it. If you all have any questions or want me to look something up and <laughs> talk about it, put it down in the comments below.
can get any more zoomed out than that, yeah? So, yeah, when you look at this thing as a whole, you can see down there, you can see off into the distance there, hopefully, and off into the distance there, hopefully. Um, but this one, this down here is very important to me because normally, yeah, you can see out in any painting. Um, you really want to create, I want to create many perspectives so you can stare at this from 10 feet away, two feet away and look and see something. You're like, oh, as a whole, it's supposed to feel normal. Like when you're out in nature, mother nature.